From the beginning, it was the biggest of projects, a billion dollar idea built with past failures in mind. There's an entire snow management system that's been built and put in place and actually is working. But that state-of-the-art drainage system quickly sprang a leak and MSFA sprang into action. The fixes have to be permanent to really protect the public and I have full confidence that that is what is occurring right now and, and that we'll get resolution here in the next few weeks. And for a while, it seemed it was working as fans flocked to the skyline's newest darling. Driving in, it's unbelievable to look at, especially at night with the lights. It looked great. I love it. You know, it like a boat. Turns out the building will need a completely new facade because of leaks and wind damage. MSFA and Mortensen say all parties agreed it was in the MSFA's best interest to replace the original exterior enclosure with a superior system to what is currently in place. The cost, more than $21 million. It's estimated it will take two years to repair the panels. It took two and a half years to build U.S. Bank. I'd like to have a word with whoever designed that, you know. First the birds, now the panels. What's next? Well, for cost, taxpayers are off the hook. Mortensen Construction and seven others involved in the build will pick up the entire cost of the unforeseen renovation. The construction company, all these other folks are going to be picking up the tab. Congratulations, they should. In Minneapolis, Susan Elizabeth Littlefield, WCCO 4 News.